This is Jonah Lomu Rugby. Now, don't worry, you haven't stepped back 10 years to when Jonah Lomu was actually playing rugby. Um, he's just the face that they've put on this, uh, on this game. Are there no new players to put as the face of the game? You would think. Not on Grewcock. <laughs> Isn't that like going Maradona's pro football? Yes, it is. <laughs> it's, um, it's an outdated reference, and ironically, this is quite an outdated game. While the likes of FIFA and uh, Pez have moved on... Are they playing on the planet Venus there? So do you see yep. the sun? The yep. sun. <laughs> There's three of them. Extreme sun bloom. <laughs> while, while games like FIFA and Pez have moved on, uh, and sort of, you know, they feel very modern and next gen. This just feels really old. And, the, and basically, the rugby games haven't moved on since the uh, since the PS2 era. All it is is um, it's it's uh, 29 men chasing one man with the ball, do, what do you running think? across the field to get round other players. <laughs> uh, you know, it's just it's not very good. And you know, in a way, it, it's completely unacceptable. Why haven't rugby games evolved? Is it because you think publishers don't see it as a big enough market to give a big budget and a big team to? I think so. Yeah, I think the the uh, the market's smaller than it is for for things like football and for you know basketball and American football. Yeah, it's a bit less so good. So they don't they don't they don't spend any money on it. Um, this Jonah Lomu rugby has got uh, Premiership license in it, licenses in it, so you will get to play as the likes of Bath and Newcastle as you see here. Um, don't expect the players to look anything like they do in real life because they just don't. Uh, they they don't even look like waxwork versions of them. They're just <laughs> dreadful. Um, and unfortunate. And it's got a few. Uh, I think it's Whoa, got Magnus and teams ball. in. Ghost ball. You'll notice the international kits uh, for most teams on current. That is because. Uh, the other rival rugby game, the Rugby World Cup game, had most of the international licences in. Uh, so, you know, this this is neither one thing nor the other, really. Is this, this Pez is, to the other one's FIFA, or is it not? Uh, this is more like FIFA to the other one's Pez because it, it's slightly better and it does have more licences in it. Yeah. Um, unfortunately, it's still not very good. Uh, and I think rugby fans really will feel sort of very short-changed by it. Um, is that the developer's name on the grass? No. Oh. Uh, the, yeah, it is. Yeah, painted on there. It is. Um, so vain. Yeah. Uh, t tactically, it's lacking. Um, Realism-wise, it's lacking. Likeness-wise, it's, it's just lacking. So. Um, <laughs> in, in a word, lacking. <laughs> in a word, lacking. And if you're looking for a satisfying rugby experience, just keep looking.